Hey everyone, how's it going? This is Michael for Spirit Comics. Welcome to my monthly New Comic Book Day haul video. I decided, well, since February went by so fast that I would do one at the end of the month. If you're new to my channel, please do subscribe and smash that notification bell so you hopefully don't miss any new uploads. If you're a returning subscriber, please do like and share this video. Also, comment. You know, tell me what you bought during the month. So, on with the show. This is for February 6th. First off, from DC, we have Harley Quinn, number 58, and I'm sure you're all, you've all heard about this. the Captain Marvel movie coming up. Well, Marvel is putting out these cool true believers comics that they do every now and then and this showcases some of her better stories this is Captain Marvel all out action as Miss Marvel uh Spider-Man and Miss Marvel. Adventures of the Super Sons. From, from Marvel. Avengers number 14. Now you have to wonder what the person was thinking when they made this one. I mean, really. <laughs> Tony Stark, Iron Man, number eight. Unnatural, number seven from Image Comics. And then from Dynamite, Vampirella, Rose for the Dead. And also... Something that I think will be worth the price. Man and Superman, written by Marv Wolfman. $10, but as you see here, it's a 100-page super spectacular. So that was February 6th. Put these back in the bag. If I can. Now, for the second week in February, which was the 13th, <coughs> pardon me, <coughs> I didn't get much during that week, but here's what I brought home. From Dynamite Comics, Vampirella and Dejah Thoris, number five. 
Mr. and Mrs. X, number eight, from Marvel Comics. Captain Marvel, number two. I love this cover. Wonder Woman, number 64, Monsters in the Basement. From DC Comics. Detective Comics, number 998, Hellbat and Hellfire. From IDW, Star Trek versus Transformers, number four. From Boom Studios, Go-Go Power Rangers, number 17. From Dynamite, Vampirella, special Valentine's Day issue. And also more True Believers comics from Marvel about Captain Marvel. And this is the original from uh, the one before Miss Marvel. This is Captain Marvel. And I think this is another Captain Marvel story. So that was for February 13. Here's the next. This was for February 20th. And I get all of my comics from Purple Earth here in Huntington, West Virginia. From Marvel, Return of Wolverine number 5. Now that a friendly Neighborhood Spider-Man, number three. Avengers, number 15. From Image Comics, Exor Sisters, number five. Black Widow, number two. Dazzler. This is a uh, I for this is a facsimile. This is a reprint of an old Dazzler comic book. As you can see, it has the comic code authority up there, and inside is even the original advertisements reprinted. More true believers ish issues. Uh. Captain Marvel, the Kree Scroll War. Now, I was a little bit hesitant about this one, but I decided to buy it anyway. This is uh, when somebody else started writing Captain, Mar Captain Marvel. Well, this is when she became, I think, Captain Marvel. And... This issue is when she became somebody named Binary, which looks a lot hotter. And no pun intended. <laughs> that was for February 20th. So have you all bought any of these? Normally... I don't buy the True Believers comics unless, you know, they're for somebody that I have an interest in. Okay, this last one is for February 27. 
from Boom Studios, Mighty Morph from Power Rangers number 36. From Marvel, Fantastic Four number 7. X-Force number 3. Wonder Woman number 65, The Steadily Sting of Nemesis. Detective Comics number 999. <laughs> that cover is just. <laughs> uh, it's funny. Shazam number 3. Batman Beyond number 29. The Last Robin? True Believers, Captain Marvel Betrayed Avengers. Now this is a classic story. You can tell by the artwork. The new Miss Marvel. I like that outfit. I do. Personally, in my opinion... Looks better on Carol Danvers than it does on Kamala Khan. Captain Marvel Avengers. And this is a... I, I, I was hesitant about this one too, but I got it anyway. Captain Marvel Braver and Mightier. So, Marvel Comics is really pushing her right now because they want people to go to the movie. They just don't realize moviegoers and comic book and comic book buyers are not the same. Oh well. Anyways, that's what I got for this month. I hope you enjoyed this video. I'm going to have a blast reading all this. So, leave your comments down below. What did you buy during February? And if you enjoyed this video, share it with your friends and show it to them so they can enjoy it and share it with someone else. Till next time, true readers, I am Michael for Spirit Comics.